No, oh, damn it. Why can I get this damn eyeliner right? Ah, oh, you look like a damn raccoon. Oh, no, you know what? I'll take a break. I'll take a break from that. I already wasted so much of this damn pencil. Hmm? Oh, I forgot you were on the bed. <laughs> uh, I forgot you were there. No, it's fine. I don't need any help. It's not like you'd be much of an asset anyway. <laughs> you know what I mean. The last time you tried doing anything on me, like my nails... You absolutely messed up my nails. <laughs> For goodness sakes, you were getting it on my fingers. Look, as much as I would love for you to have a certain mess on my fingers, nail polish is not one of them. So, I'll get it right eventually. I just need more patience. Well, it usually takes me, on a good day, maybe five minutes. <laughs> That's on a really good day. But typically, ten. But for some reason, I just can't get it right. <sighs> there's nothing wrong with my hand. I don't think there's anything wrong with my aim, as you would know. I always hit that spot correctly, don't I? <laughs> You know what I'm talking about. <laughs> I don't want to go into it because you already know YouTube doesn't take so kindly to me. <laughs> uh, you're always so flustered. We've been together for like, how long? <laughs> and you're still this flustered shy boy. But then again, you are pretty naughty. You are. Don't try to deny it. <laughs> like I said, we've been together for this long. I know all of your dirty secrets. Or at least most of it. <laughs> You're not that shy and innocent as you may seem to others. Uh, if they only knew what I know. <laughs> You're just a dirty boy. And you will always be that dirty boy. Ah, <laughs> uh, yeah. I must admit, I am glad you talked to me back then in that hallway in college. We are still in college, but I'm glad you talked to me then, because I certainly wouldn't. <laughs> don't get offended. I don't mean it in a malicious way. I don't really talk to anyone. Even people that I may like. Mm hmm so that's why I'm glad you talked to me, because I would be too hesitant to talk to you. No, oh, be patient. I'm trying again. Here, hold on. We have the time. It's not like we're leaving right now. We have to leave in an hour. And I'm already all dressed up. I just have to do this. Damn, you're impatient. No. Trust me, I would. I would leave without my eyeliner. But uh, I just feel naked without it. Maybe I should do something a bit more simple than this. Mm, I'll just do one small line. Uh... I think that'll work, yeah. <sighs> Time to do the left eye. I can't do the left eye correctly. Damn it. I've been screwing up the right eye for so long, I might screw up the left one. <laughs> it might even look worse. Damn. Ah, come on. Now, is this even? Babe, is this even? Not the time to be sarcastic, is it even? Thank you. Finally, 
Weirdly enough, the left eye took the shortest. Uh, now we just have to wait. Oh, uh, love, can you go get my choker from the closet? I forgot about it. Mm-hmm. It should be on the, I believe, uh, the drawer, the second one. Yes. Why are you so shocked that all my clothes, well, not all, are basically black? I have black, gray, maybe navy blue. Uh, yeah, there's a navy blue in there. Uh, basically dark shaded colors. Why are you so surprised? You're acting like it's the first time you saw my closet. <laughs> You've seen it multiple times. You've worn stuff from my closet multiple times. And I know you still have at least three of my hoodies in your own room. So don't act so surprised. So what? What, is your closet like full of pink and neon bright colors or something because if so please don't let me open that because i don't want to get blind Ugh. getting blind at my age is really not feasible considering how i rely on aesthetics to feel nice about myself anyway just give me the uh, choker please thank you <sighs> what is this request? I don't like your requests. Every time you say you have a request, and specifically that word request, it's typically something that's not PG friendly. Uh huh, I swear all you want, it's not gonna work. And besides, you swearing. That it's PG is making that very suspicious. Hey, you can't blame me. You just asked for it. And all I simply did was just deliver on that request. It's not my fault you got a little too frisky with me and I got carried away. You know what you're doing. So, if it really is PG... Then why don't you just tell me the request? Sitting on my lap. Okay, now you know that's not just going to be PG. No, 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 no. You already know. I know what you're planning to. It's not PG. You're not just simply going to sit on my lap. Uh-huh, no, you're not going to. I know what you're going to do. Perhaps you'll just kind of move around while sitting on my lap, making me a little excited and also making you excited because you're making me excited and it leads to something else and then we get dirty. So I can't really afford that now, can we? It'll be a shame to be late to the event simply because you and I got carried away. Look, no matter how much you may beg, you can kiss my feet if you want to, but I'm not going to give in. I don't actually get down. Oh, get up. Get, get up. No, no. No. You are something else. What are you going to do now? <laughs> are you going to, like, do something else that's not appropriate? Somewhere around my hip area, the front of it? No, no, get away from that area. No. You said you wanted to sit on my lap, not... Do this, not eat a banana. No, no, don't do that. You can whine, like I said, all you want. I'm not giving in. Give me your puppy eyes for all I care. It's not going to happen. 
you can act all submissive and cute, but once again, for the 800th time, it's not going to happen, no matter how tempting it is to pin you on the bed and just utterly wreck you. <laughs> what, got excited by that comment? Dirty boy. Goodness. I hope you know you are being such a bratty boy right now. <laughs> of course you know. <sighs> such a naughty bratty boy. <laughs> Fine. No, I didn't finish. Sit down on the bed. I said sit. There you go. <sighs> I know you love it when I talk to you like this. But I can give you some sort of compromise. I will let you sit on my lap. Wait. Wait. <laughs> Do I have to talk to you like a dog? Really? But I can let you sit on my lap. However, you will get something in return. It's an item, a physical one. No, not the banana. You shut your mouth. You will get a physical item, and you will have to wear it. Uh-huh. So, do you agree to my terms? You won't get to know what item it is. You have to find out and see. Or is that too risky for you? It's just a clothing item. Don't tell me you're scared of a clothing item. I mean, it's fine. You don't have to risk it if you don't want to. <laughs> Emotional manipulation. Uh-huh, okay. Then, if what I did was emotional manipulation... What can you say about your actions, begging, and all that? Making me feel so bad about not letting you sit on my lap. Hmm. Yeah, silence, okay. So, do you agree or not? <laughs> Good boy. So... Lap now. Ah, there you go. Uh, such a good boy, but yet so very naughty. Mm -mm. Ah, no touching yet. I still need to give you this item. So hold still. I'll just put it around your neck. And there we go. Locked in. What? <laughs> Why are you so shocked? It's a pretty new collar. <laughs> with your name on it. And with my name on it as well. <laughs> my name is on it as it designates me as the owner. I know you love this type of stuff. So, don't. Act all mad. You love it, and I know you do. You're getting excited down there because of the thought of being mine. Mm-hmm. Hmm? Oh, that? Oh, that's just for a leash. Don't worry. I'm not that cruel to put you on a leash in public. Don't worry. But it'll definitely be fun in bed. Well, actually, that idea of putting you in a leash in public, although I personally wouldn't do it without your approval, I would, if you really wanted me to. Oh. <laughs> I barely even finished my sentence. I see. Oh, aren't you a kinky slut? We have 30 more minutes before we have to leave. So, I guess... I can treat you to a brief makeout session. And if you get way too excited over there, it's not my fault. You just have to deal with B. 
being a bit horny. So, suck it up. Don't do it. Not not literally. Please don't. I'll never get bored of this. So, that was that audio. Yeah, I wanted to do a goth boy audio because it's been a while since I did the last one, and I do enjoy doing these goth boy audios. It's fun. Now, with that being said, although my channel is slowly, slowly recovering, it would still be a great help if you could like, subscribe, and comment because interactions help too. And did I say subscribe? <laughs> I'm trying to get 100k, obviously. That's the goal, but I won't be just focused on that, obviously, because then I'm just bringing my channel down with me. Because I really want that um silver play button. <laughs> It'll be great to have. And with that being said, thank you all for listening. And if you like... Wait, no. Oh, I'm, I am screwing up my own outro. Oh my gosh. Gosh. Uh, gersh? Gosh? Okay. If you like this audio, please do like, subscribe, and comment. And with that being said, thank you all for listening. I will see you all in the next audio. Bye-bye. And this outro was excessively long as per usual. Ugh.